What's up everyone? This is Aaron Franzine back again with IDI Distributors. Today I want to show you the brand new Fusion PC gun. The idea with this new gun is that we want to be able to combine a lot of the little parts and O-rings and springs and screens that go into here and combine them all into one disposable cartridge. What I want to do in this video is just kind of show you some of the breakdown, the reassembly, talk about the cartridges a little bit, how long we can expect them to last, how many sets of foam we think we can get, the way that this gun is offered, which is going to be like this, a complete gun, or you can buy just the front end of this. So this is the retrofit kit that would come off. This is the same handle as this gun. So there's a lot of these handles out there floating around. If you're looking to upgrade, you can simply buy this retrofit kit, thread off your old fluid manifold and put this one on and you'll be good to go. So next we're gonna get into a little bit of disassembly and we'll talk about the cartridges and what we can expect out of them. So the new Fusion PC gun, we're gonna get into the disassembly of it. First of all, the air cap, which most people are familiar with, the new ones are stainless steel versus the old aluminum ones. So they're a little bit heavier. You can feel it's a little more dense, makes the front of the gun a little bit heavier, um, but it's gonna be a lot more durable than the old aluminum ones, which scratched and gouged very easily. So air cap, that's the change there. Retaining ring, it's a little bit different design. It's not gonna be the same one as the old guns. Um, so this is the retaining ring, and now we're down to the cartridge. This is the disposable piece. And that's it. So this cartridge basically contains the side seals, the cartridge assemblies, the springs, things like that. So the idea with this gun, it's not that we're going to solve all the world's spray foam gun problems. It's that we want to be able to break it down and fix it and repair it as soon as possible. Reducing downtime on a job site, that is the feature of this gun. So if you had gun problems before, you're probably going to have the same gun problems. It's not going to magically fix them. The idea is that we can access the mix chamber in seconds versus before with all the springs, the cartridge assemblies, the O-ring, side seals, all of that. So. Down to the mix chamber, this is the new mix chamber. It's a three-piece design, so it's got a back knuckle, which is a little more durable and heavy duty. You can feel a little more weight in this as well. And then there's a roll pin in here that holds the two pieces together. This is one part number. It's not meant to be taken apart. It's just the way that it was manufactured with Graco. So new mix chamber. And then this is the new fluid housing, which holds your cartridge assembly. So basically you have your B and your A chemicals coming in right here and then your air is up top. So we'll take this off. This is the same old handle, the same air piston, everything that we're used to seeing on the air purge gun. So if you have these, you can basically buy this retrofit kit, which is what we're looking at right here. You can thread it off, thread the new one on, and you're good to go. So a couple questions I know everyone's gonna have that I wanna answer is getting this apart, how easy is the cartridge to get out when it's full of foam after you've been using it? I totally get it, I know how it goes in the field. There's nothing worse than being on a job site, taking apart a gun with O-rings and dirt and parts flying everywhere and a contractor breathing down your neck. So. I'm gonna show you a couple quick things and kind of the idea of this gun is to avoid that. So when you're taking it apart, okay, we take off our air cap, we take off our retaining ring. I can take this apart nice and easy because it's brand new, right? But when it's full of foam and you can't take it apart, I'm gonna show you a couple of things that Graco engineered into this gun. So first off, you're gonna see right here Okay, there's a slot, and that's a flathead screwdriver slot, okay? I'll do the one from the back side, and you can pry that cartridge off. You can see it coming off there. So when it's full of foam and chemical, you can pry that off and then access your mix chamber. Still an easy, smooth process. Um, 
what I, an, another technique I want to show you, if that doesn't work, okay, so there's really three levels. You can pull it off, you can use the screwdriver pry slots here. The other thing is this is a new tool that Graco has included with both the retrofit and a new gun. So this being a new gun, it's already installed down in the handle. So where the hex plug used to be, now you take your 5 16 nut driver. And what this is, is a screw in order to pull this off. So it's kind of like a little flywheel pulley. Okay, so worst case scenario, you cannot get this thing out. It's gummed up. You take this and you put it in here and thread it in and it's gonna push against the slot on the back of this and it's gonna pry this cartridge out. So watch as I thread this in, you'll see the blue cartridge slowly start to pry itself out. Okay, so that's another way. Either way, you can access your mix chamber in seconds. So again, here's your pulley and it's in a nice convenient little location right in the bottom of your handle. So hopefully it doesn't get lost, but that's where that goes. So when you buy this retrofit kit, it comes with this new housing and this new tool in the gun. So for reassembly, take your old handle and you thread on your brand new retrofit kit. Mix chamber. Again, the nomenclature on top. Disposable cartridge. And again, we're looking for that resistance as the side seals ramp up onto the mix chamber. Retaining ring. Air cap. So moving on to the actual cartridges themselves. Um, again, this is a disposable piece. Okay, it's not meant to be rebuilt or taken apart. The time savings and where you're gonna make more money ultimately on a job is by throwing this in a bucket of solvent being TSL or an equivalent plasticizer. Um, then we can test it later. So if we have a gun problem, we think it's this, you take this off, you can set it aside for later. And then I'll go through a couple troubleshooting steps here in a second. Um, here's how you actually buy the cartridges. Okay, this is a five pack, which is the best value. Your price per unit. Uh, if you shop at like Costco and Walmart and you look at unit price, the best unit price is in a five pack, okay? You can also get it in a three pack. So the next question you probably have is how long do these last? So you're not gonna change anything the way that you currently do business and operate on a job site. The idea with this is that you can take it off, put a new one on and keep spraying. Another feature of the new gun is the new mix chamber design. We already talked about the three piece design, but I wanna add that this mix chamber is Chromex coated as well. So that Chromex coating is something Graco has been using for years. Um, they've applied it to the mix chambers. So if we can get these chambers to last a lot longer with the new hardened Chromex coating, as well as uh, the polycarb alloy side seals that the new cartridges are utilizing. Um, we don't wanna be replacing these as often. So our goal is that instead of replacing maybe six to 10 of these a year, maybe we're only replacing them once or twice. So I wanted to point that out, uh, another feature of the new mix chamber in the new Graco Fusion PC gun. So now that we're all experts in the features and benefits of the new Fusion PC gun from Graco, uh, I want to reiterate the point of this gun, okay? It's that we want to reduce downtime. Having customers angry because we're rebuilding guns and jobs not being done efficiently, rebuilding guns on a job site, uh, maintaining a parts inventory on your rig with all the O-rings and springs and side seals that are involved, 
you know, we want to keep everything into a couple easy components. We want it to be easy to train on. So, you know, with some of the labor shortage discussions and training and keeping your guys up to date on the products, I can train somebody on this gun in minutes versus some of the other guns out there. You need to spend a lot more time with them, breaking them down. You need somebody to help maintain a parts inventory. You know, we've all seen the Folgers can or the five gallon bucket filled with solvent and all these random gun parts that's impossible to manage. So with your employees, this gun's easy to train on. It's easy to maintain inventory. It's super quick to rebuild and get to your mix chamber. Um, so use this gun to maximize your time on a job site. That's what our goal is. The less time you're on a job site, the more profitable that you're gonna be. And we feel that this gun is gonna be a huge hit and help customers make more money. So contact your local IDI branch for more details. Again, this gun will be available in February and we'll be happy to help you. Thanks for watching and have a great day.